Does accelerated self-healing work for animals? Actually, it works faster for animals. Animals don't, aren't as complex as we are. The mind and spirit aspect is a little simpler. We tend to be complex. And as we get older, we get more complex too because of past exposures and experiences that we didn't fully heal. We carry that extra baggage along with us as adults and as we age. So, but yes, animals absolutely, in most cases, respond much faster than human beings. They're much simpler, more like infants tend to be pretty simple, not always, but a healthy infant certainly. It might only need a flower essence to work with a certain psycho-emotional pattern that's where they're stuck. If their body is healthy, it's their mind and spirit struggling with, you know, it's like the, maybe the, the baby really wants to be using the fork like it sees its family using and just can't figure out how to get there from where they're at. And there's a frustration. And, you know, the, the, the emotional stresses begin to affect the body if they're not resolved and relieved. If it's held over time, any energy pattern can be, if it's out of balance, what can begin to structure in as like a fossil of that imbalance on the, on the chemical and even the morphological structural level the shape of the body can be altered. And that's where I believe uh, most disease ultimately comes from. If we can pick up these problems and resolve them at a, a level of, of mental and emotional stresses, at a level of, you know, it's just a, uh, you know, an acute toxin exposure, an acute trauma, if we can support the healing of that, you know, I think of uh, a boy who, who totally blew out his knee in a soccer injury, injury and uh, the physicians had the opinion based on the, what they've seen and based on the severity of the injury that he might never walk again. Well, it, with this kind of support for accelerated self-healing, not only he walked again, but he played soccer again. And they looked at an MRI, I forget how long, six months or a year down the road, somewhere in that range, and they actually couldn't tell that there was an injury. So our body is always healing. If there's remnants of past incomplete healings, we can move through those and complete those processes and get closer to our genetic potential for health and well-being.